You are listening to The Bad Boy Radio Show with Mr. Locario and Miles Cunningham. This is that real shit, not that fake shit. The only radio show that's not afraid to tell you the truth about the game. This is The Bad Boy Radio Show. Remember, the truth is inside you. I only wanted to know if you was dealing with a girl and you didn't get to hit, and you charged into the game because she was like disrespectful or whatever. If she's coming back to you and 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 she's like basically letting you know she want to give you some pussy, should you take it or should you keep it moving because she was on some disrespectful shit, you know, from the beginning, which is why you charged her. You understand what I'm saying? So you're basically saying, should he take should he take it? You know, if she's throwing a pussy at him at this point, should he take it? You understand what I'm saying? Now. This is, this is what I would say. I actually would say no. Now, the reason why I say that is this. See, I say if you was in a situation where, let's say, you were supposed to get, uh, you was trying to get shit popping with a girl and things just didn't turn out that way for whatever, for like logistics or let's say even if she just flaked or whatever and then she's trying to come back and get some pussy, whatever, or let's say, um, you know, yeah, like it was just like for other reasons, it just didn't go down and y'all kind of lost contact or whatever. And then she comes back at that point. I'm like, yeah, you can, you know, it's not a big deal. Yeah. Just tell her to come through and, and suck your dick, whatever it is like that. But if a girl is actually being disrespectful, though, you understand what I'm saying? If she was being disrespectful and she did some crazy ass disrespectful shit, like let's say a girl fucking cursed you out, called you a bitch through a fucking her shoes at you and shit and, and, and did some crazy shit. And then, and, and, and then all of a sudden, like a month later, she hitting you up to my, yo, what's up? Like, can I come over? And we get, like, nah, you understand what I'm saying? Like she's done because the thing is, is that she violated, you understand already at this point. So you, you taking her back or you, you dealing with her is disrespectful to yourself. Right. In, meaning that you don't really have any respect for yourself. You understand what I'm saying? Which means that you will basically do anything for pussy. You understand? Is it, is, it, is it that guys out there think that a woman gives you giving you pussy means that she that she's respecting you? I hope not. Or maybe they just like they don't give a fuck. They just want pussy so bad that <clears throat> that a chick disrespected them, they just don't care. You understand what I'm saying? Does he what does he explain anything about what kind of disrespect? Nah, he just said like being disrespectful and shit. So yeah. and I'm I'm just taking I'm just taking it at like onto the extreme of like her just being on some crazy disrespectful shit and then she come back. I think you need to kick kick her to the curb. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? You 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 doing all right without having fucked her to this point, then what's right. the exactly again this this like that type of shit is like look. Charging women to the game is a is a normal thing. Mm-hmm. Women are here to get charged mm-hmm. constantly. Right. You see, you 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 guys is you know you a lot of these dudes they they look at the fact that women like you know they oh yeah you know women they turn guys down left and right. Mm-hmm. Here's what y'all niggas don't understand. Y'all should be turning bitches down left and right too. Exactly. 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 Like you should be. Char- I told y'all, y'all should be. If you're not charging hoes to the game constantly, there's something that you're not doing right. Mm-hmm. There's something that you're not doing. You're not doing right. But again, like a lot of these dudes, just they just want the pussy so bad. They they just really don't care. You know, they don't care about their own respect, their own integrity. Right. How, you know how they actually feel about themselves. Like they really they, they just don't give a fuck, bro. But all pussy ain't good pussy, my nigga. Like, right. Especially if she was disrespectful. Now, <laughs> you have certain situations where it just didn't work out or maybe the yeah, schedules was off. Right. That's different. And, and she hit you back up like, hey, what's up? Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, you, you could give it another go. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But 
if you if you you know you put all your cards out there and she she fucking shitted on you or disrespected you or acted like you or she acted like she didn't recognize the value or she couldn't see or I don't need to we don't need to talk girl we don't need to talk like we're done we're, <laughs> done. we're done and 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 the thing is it, the 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 thing is the the rare exception is that she would have to be crawling on her hands and knees begging crying and then on top of that you would have to say listen you're going to have to do some fucking work for a while like mm-hmm. i got you got to i got to you got to at least 6 months of consistent cooperation before i even give you the dick mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying like you got to or you got to give me some paper you got to give me like 10 g's to make up for your disrespect or something like there yeah. has to be something where she has it's just like when a person commits a crime right they either got to pay a fine or they got to go to jail they right. got they got to do the time so the chick got to do the time if she was if she was that fucking disrespectful right right how you just going to give her a, a fucking gift you understand dick is a gift you know what i mean like it's like it's a gift how are you going to give it it's a, a gift? gift yo because guys we have to remember that Letting girls fuck us is a privilege. Mm-hmm. Look, yo, the other day I was chilling, and that you remember that song we talking about rappers early, right? Mm. You, you remember that song that um Fifty Cent did a while back, and um, so the first the first joint he did was in the club, right? Right. S- second song that he did like this on the second album was Candy Shop. Remember? Right. Right. But do you remember the third one that he did? It was called Amusement Park. Mm-hmm. Right. And I was just thinking about like myself and I was thinking about men in general. And I'm like, yo, when you when you kind of understand what you what you're doing and what you're providing for these chicks. And a, a lot of times mm. you're, you're literally an amusement park for these hoes. Right. Mm-hmm. You understand? And, and I started playing the song and I was like, yo, this nigga 50 is a fucking genius. Mm hmm. Because a lot of it, a lot of it is really for their enjoyment, right? Because even when you think you're enjoying a female's body, mm-hmm. she's enjoying you enjoying her. Don't you get it? Right. Exactly. Because a bitch is loving the attention of you complimenting her, touching her, feeling mm-hmm. her up, kissing mm-hmm. on her, telling her how sexy she is. Right. Pursuing her, mm-hmm. being close to her, and she's smelling your cologne and all of this shit. Right. That's what she she loves. You think you're just enjoying the bitch. No, bro. Mm-hmm. The bitch is enjoying you enjoying her. Right. And then on top of that, she gets to sit on your stiff fucking phallus. Mm-hmm. And literally ride that shit like it's a fucking amusement park. Right. Like it's a goddamn roller coaster. Like it's a some ride at some amusement park. Mm-hmm. And if you're the type of nigga that know what you're doing, she could ride the shit all night. Right. And yeah, yeah, yo, hit the fucking button again, man. Exactly. Dick is a gift. <laughs> because y'all, y'all really think y'all really think that a bitch is doing y'all a favor. Mm-hmm. But even while you fucking the shit out of her, and you think you're enjoying yourself. She's having a better time. Trust me. Right. But a lot of you guys, you're not aware of this type of shit because you haven't had enough pussy in your life yet. Mm-hmm. You understand? Yo, some yo, mad times. I just be, I, I just be behind the bitch. Mm-hmm. Just dropping the dick in the ass, like just dropping the dick from behind on it. And I'm just like, I'm just looking at them, shaking my head, like, <sighs> <laughs> these fucking bitches just. They just get all this. They get all of these gifts. Right. You understand? They get every fucking thing they want. They get attention. You understand? They get they get the safety and security of knowing that I'm that I'm not going to rape them. Right. That I'm not doing anything to hurt them. But everything I'm doing right now is for their fucking pleasure, literally. Mm -hmm. And they get they get to take total enjoyment in that. Right. And I'm supposed to think she's doing me a favor. Mm hmm. But see, that's the trick, though. That's the trick. That's the fucking... And, and that's why niggas is called tricks. Right. You understand? Because y'all niggas is out here simping and, and paying and... 
because you think that when a woman open up her legs, she's doing you a favor. Right. When the truth is, it's, it's, the, it's the total opposite. It's the total opposite. Mm-hmm. And, and all who wasn't you who told me this shit when you was like, um, stick your finger in your ear and, and, and oh yeah, I heard that from somewhere. It's like stick your finger in the ear and scratch it or whatever. It's like what well, it feels better, your finger in your ear, right? Right. <laughs> yo, is it, cause when I yo when I what I, I told I told niggas this in one of my videos. I'm like, look, all I ever hear when I'm fucking chicks is I'm hearing my name. I'm hearing, this feels so good. I'm hearing that dick is so good. That's all I'm hearing. Right. So at this stage in the game, it's I'm just looking at it like, no, like I can't give every bitch the privilege of fucking me. Mm-hmm. Do you understand? So you have to you have to make the choices in that type of way where it's like, nah, if a bitch is disrespectful, if a bitch is not with it or if she's not doing what you need her to do, mm. she won't get no dick. Right. Dick is not only a gift, it's a privilege. Mm-hmm. It's a pri- I'm I'm so real, bro. Because mm-hmm. again, even when you think you're enjoying her, right? She's enjoying you. Mm-hmm. She's enjoying you enjoying her as well. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? Facts. Oh my god. Like it's it's so crazy. It's like what we what we give when a man understands his value, what you actually give to a woman, what you bring to her life mm-hmm. is is literally fucking priceless. Right. Literally. Mm-hmm. But you only get to that point when your mind gets to that point. Right. You see what I'm saying? When your mind gets to that point and you start to realize, oh shit, like these bitches been using me for an amusement park all these years. Right. Like all y'all niggas that think y'all got high body counts and, and this, that, and the third, a lot of y'all niggas is just dudes that bitches decided to take advantage of. Right. For 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 one or two nights, and and then you be like, damn, how she ghosts me like that. <laughs> because she even realized that you don't realize what's going on. Right. And because she re- when she, she realized you don't know what's going on, she realized you don't have any respect for yourself. And right. when a bitch, when a bitch realizes that a nigga don't got no respect for himself, it is one of the biggest turns off that she will ever ex- ever experience. Mm-hmm. That's why she fucking ghosts you. Right. That's why the, that's why these niggas calling up talking about yo yeah my body count like in the two hundreds. But could you tell me could you tell me why bitches do this though? Right. Right. Because y'all niggas is giving up the gift, and you and you don't you don't understand the value of the gift that you're giving. Right. Do you understand? Mm-hmm. Y'all niggas is just giving up dick left to right, thinking that you're having a good time when the, when the, the bitch is stealing all the gold mm. right from under your nose. Right. And you sit, you sit, you sit in there. Yeah, you got one more nacho on your body count, but you don't even realize the transaction that just took place. Right. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? But y'all get there though. Keep fucking with us. Y'all will get there. Exactly. That's facts. But let's take a quick break, real quick. Uh, when we come back. We're going to be talking about, you know, why women fool guys who ain't got no goddamn game. You feel me? Thanks for watching and make sure you click the link below or go straight to patreon.com slash Mr. Locario so you can watch all the other bad boy show episodes. And there's also exclusive stuff on the Patreon. So make sure you guys click the link below or go straight to patreon.com slash Mr. Locario.